There is a natural peace and harmony among the creation and the universe. Almost every living thing is keeping this harmony and balance attuned. However, human beings are intervening and ruining this balance and harmony. We are polluting the world with our anger, jealousy, envy, animosity, hatred, prejudices, ego, and many other contemptuous feelings with the excuse of a better life, nationalism, or religion. In order to keep this peace and harmony, it is vital that we get to know each other. Knowing is the first step in the road leading to love and the peace that is to be practiced by the peacekeepers. Accepting everyone for who they are, having a chair for everyone in our heart, open your heart so wide like the ocean, become inspired with faith and love for others, offer a hand to those in trouble, and be concerned about everyone. These virtue codes are from the Honorable Fatula Gulen, Peace Islands Institute's source of inspiration and honorary president. The recipient of East West Institute 2011 Peace Award, 2008 Forbes Magazine's Top Intellectual, writer of over 60 books, an inspiration for millions of people from different walks of life. He sees love as the essence of the creation. And in this over-polluted world where evil is everywhere, if there is something that has been left untouched and clean, that is love among all the fading ornaments of this life. If there is a beauty that has preserved its magnificence and charm without fading, that is also love. We do believe in this immaculate love, which is embedded in the essence of humanity. Because of this trust, we have come to establish peace islands around the essential features of knowing and loving. Peace Islands is a place where peacekeepers live. Peace Islands Institute, PII, is a nonprofit organization that aspires to bring together different points of view. The central philosophy of PII is to unite voices using the spirit of mutual respect and acceptance. Peace Islands Institute's headquarters is located in Manhattan, including branches in upstate New York, New Jersey, Connecticut, Pennsylvania, Massachusetts, and New Hampshire. The goal is to develop original and alternative perspectives on social phenomena as they relate to our lives by presenting explanations as well as solutions. By supporting successful practices, we can contribute to achieving world peace while creating realms of peaceful coexistence, or as we like to call them, peace islands. Peace Islands Institute summarizes humanity's problems under three categories. These are disunity, ignorance, and poverty. It offers four solutions, unity, education, welfare, and progress. In order to actively engage in the problems and offer solutions, Peace Islands Institute establishes five centers the Center for Global Affairs. This envisions a future in which people work together to bring solutions to common global problems of humanity, such as climate change, ecological problems, conflict areas, environmental issues, global economy, and human trafficking. The Center for Global Affairs organizes panels, seminars, and conferences on global issues for public awareness and public benefit. The Center for Social Affairs this addresses socioeconomic and cultural issues of the local areas and cities in order to bring innovative solutions into action. Most pressing social problems of our society like homelessness, poverty, and child abuse can be solved by bringing the professionals to participate in debates and talk on these issues. 
The desired outcome of these debates is the proposal of effective solutions that can be put into action with the help of NGOs and public officials. The Center for Interfaith Affairs. This provides a common ground of dialogue for every faith and non-faith traditions to discuss, explore, and understand each other, and to also offer suggestions for the common problems that affect humanity. Discussion series, panels, visits, trips, conferences, dinners, book clubs, and active community services are being continuously organized by the Center for Interfaith Affairs. Educational problems of the individuals and societies are the prominent challenges of the community. From the lack of motivation of the teachers to high college tuitions, we suffer from copious educational problems and issues. The Center for Education arranges panels, seminars, and conferences with other educational institutions and NGOs to find innovative solutions to lessen these problems. By bringing ideas and being part of the solution, CFE aims to uplift the quality of life. The Center for Media. This provides panels and seminars on media-related issues with media professionals from both national and international spheres. Its efforts are dedicated to promote and support media literacy as a framework for accessing, analyzing, and evaluating the new media landscape. This helps citizens develop critical thinking and gain confidence to live life fully in the 21st century media culture. The Center for Media also provides an array of publications and printed materials for PII, such as books, reports, articles, and visual documentations. PII organizes many events. Here are some of them. National and international conferences, panels, lectures, luncheons, ambassadors series, senate talks, national and international trips, retreat programs, film screenings, young peace builders projects, interfaith gatherings, Abraham's table and book signings.